the Chow Chin Chows, Josh B, it's Games here, welcome back to another episode of the Pokemon Vault White Egglock, and before we get on with this episode today, I want to mention the fact that Alder jumped down from this mountain in the last episode. I'm on top of this mountain, I can't do a darn thing, how come I can't jump down from the mountain? Anyway, hey, uh, in the last episode, we went on sort of a little anime arc, really, basically, because the fact is, I lost the Pokemon right here to Charon, thanks to an energy ball, and I got a little scared. You know what I did? I went to go and got more Pokemon. I went to Route 18, I went to Route 17, how we got an egg and grinding as well, which got hatched into a level 1 Pokemon, which is awesome, which I will show you as soon as we get to a Pokemon Center. Plus, I did some grinding. I may have done a little too much grinding. Let's take a look at the team. First off, we have Ares, level 67. Uh, with Fire Punch, Thunder Punch, Aura Spear, and Magma Storm. Magma Storm is, the, is a move that Heat Ran can get. That's awesome. Then we have Spirit Flame, level 67, with Will O Wisp, uh, Shadow Ball, Heat Wave, and Calm Mind. Basically, Spirit Flame's moveset's not changed ever since we got Shadow Ball. Basically, Shadow Ball just like perfected the moveset that we have already. And look at this special attack stat. It is. Amazing, 253 base, 253 uh, special attack, that is awesome. Then we have Little Star, level 67, with Slash, Sword Stance, Night Slash, and Psycho Cut. Learn Psycho Cut whilst grinding, and look at that attack stat, that is all, that is just, I swear it's just as big. Oh, it's like 10 points different. It's like 10 points difference. It's still really good for Little Star. And Little Star's been here for a very long time. And so, so Spirit Flame. Then we have Gore. Our, Ry our Rhyperia, which uh, I have been leveling up and grinding. It's awesome. Earthquake, Hammer Arm, uh, Ice Fang, and Dragon Rush on its moveset. And level 67. Awesome. Then we have Thick, level 67, with Sea Bomb, Leech Sea, Curse, and Earthquake. And then we have Gerard, level 67, with Discharge, Signal Beam, Try Attack, and Recover. And that's the team. It's a really good team. I'm really enjoying it now. I think I think the tr the bear, I think the trouble days are behind us now. Maybe it's because I did a bit too much grinding, but I think we're okay now. I'm probably not going to be grinding until we reach the Elite Four now, because of this reason. Unless we get slaughtered. Then things might start happening. But I don't think... I, I really don't want to get slaughtered. But then again, this is Dreyanu we're talking about. Of course we're going to get slaughtered. Yeah, Dreyanu is good for that. Dreyanu is good for slaughtering people. I just got in the door. And he already wants to... He already wants to take me apart. Yeah. Let's put repels on. I also have a dubious disc that I don't know what to do with. I don't even know if I'm actually even going to use it. That's the annoying thing about this. I don't know whether I should use this dubious disc or not. That's us repels. Ah, there's Clay. And Sharon. Oh, Joanne. Well, what a surprise seeing you here. Uh, whilst I was expecting my mountain, Twist Mountain, you two seem to be a bit rugged more uh, than I saw you last time. Little bit, anyway. Is that so? By the by, if you folks seen those Team Plasma out lately? After all the trouble we had, it, we gym leaders met up and we had a little chat. But we got no clue to where they are. They, it's like they're hiding under a rock. A rock that's called a Pokemon League, that is. Well, not much for us to do than wait until they move. Anyhow, that's none of your concern. Squirts like you should just enjoy traveling with your Pokemon. Twist Mountain's a fine place to explore. You'll have some fun if you just leave this here path. Well, I better be. I better just leave it to yourself instead of just instead of you just listening to me, Yammer. Be seen, your sprouts. 
Feel free to train yourself in my mountain as long as you can, as long as you like. I thought he was going to get us involved in all that bother again, so I was bracing myself before I knew it. I'm going there. I'm going in first. I'll be seeing you. Okay, so we're not getting involved in this whole uh, malarkey with Team Plasma again, which is good because I really don't want to be involved in the whole malarkey with Team Plasma again. Team Plasma are very annoying people, especially if N has a, a battle soon, which I think he does. I think we do have another N battle coming up soon, which I'm kind of, which I would be kind of scared for. Also, we have Bryson to deal with too. And I've been looking at his team, and a lot of his team have Shadow Ball. So, Chandelure is not going to be a fun thing to be dealing with. We're going to put Thick up front for the moment in time because there's a hiker here and it might be a good idea. We'll see. I am quite decided yet whether this is a good idea. I hope this is a good idea. You have three Pokemon. You Oh, this is a good idea. Good. That's a Suno Wuna. What do I want to talk about for question of the day? Oh, sea bomb. Suck a punch. Ow. That's a crit. Don't do that. <laughs> anyway, yeah, I should probably talk about quite. Oh, you have sturdy. I was not expecting you to have sturdy. Fine, I'll sea bomb you again. Die. It's like a machine gun going off. There we go. And a crustal. Oh. Can I earthquake that? Or is ground resist? Because bug is. Uh... I actually don't even know what I can do to this. I really don't know what I can do to this. I'm going into gore. I actually really don't know what to do to crustal. Yeah, I'm going to go into gore. I'm going to earthquake. I can't stay in with a. Uh, I can't stay in with the other Pokemon because I'm, I'm scared of a cross scissor, which would be really bad. So I'm gonna earthquake here. Might be a bad idea. Actually, that did really nicely. Shell smash. This thing is legit league ready. Crustles, crustle is going to kill me. X scissor. I was it. I didn't do that much damage to me at all. If you'd use something, maybe like Giga Drain or Leaf Blade or something that would do some damage to me, then this would be a different story. But you didn't. You decided to use other things. I can Ice Fang this. Poison Fang. I should do nothing. It literally does nothing. Ice Fang does everything. Yep. See? Down you go. I mean, almost got level 68 from that too. Which is also good, but also bad since I'm in with a level right now. Maybe I shouldn't face... You know what? I'm not going to face every gym trainer, every trainer I come across. I'm going to try and avoid trainers for a bit. I don't know how well I'm going to do it, but we'll see. I think the only other trainer I want to face in here is the Doctor Trainer, which would be good. Most Doctor Trainers are, you know, heal my team and everything. I know that trainers like to hide in this, uh, in these uh, mountains, which really annoy me too. Anyway, question of the day for today's episode. What am I going to talk about? Um, I actually really don't know what to talk about because I don't, I don't have an idea of what question of the day should be. Uh, maybe it should be some. I mean, Pokemon Go's just. Uh, if you're uh, watching this, Pokemon Go's just. Uh, there's been a leak of Pokemon Go, and it's okay. I mean, I'm not particularly interested in Pokemon Go. I never have been. It's not knife. It's like it's gonna be interesting. I mean, I'm not really interested in all these freemium games for Pokemon in the first place because the fact is, I just like them. I just like the main series. I was never a fan of pick. I don't like pick the cross. I don't like shuffle. I just don't like all these games that have all these uh, mediums. 
of, of, of ways to pay for them, and they're really annoying for that. But, you know what? Question of the day for today's episode. What is your favourite video game other than Pokemon? Let me know in the comment section down below. That's what today's question is. What's your favourite video game series other than Pokemon? Ooh, Nugget. That's nice. That's, that's a dud. If I go for that item there, I know, I think that's one. You know what? To, to, to hell with it. I'm going to do it. Why do you just, like, why? Why is that a thing? Why do people, like, hide underground and wait for trainers to come past? You have an extra drill. Okay, I'm leading with the right Pokemon. Uh, let's curse. And let's go for a, uh, let's go for a, uh, Let's go for an Earthquake. She's swords dancing up. Let's go for an Earthquake. We've... S I've done enough. You, like, stop setting up. You sh you shouldn't set up. I should have set... I was the only one who had set up here. I'm the only one who had set up here. You need to die. There we go. Uh, Hiri Armor. Um, I have nothing to deal with Hiri Armors. Like, literally. Guess we'll go into Spirit Flame, maybe? But then again, maybe Knock Off is a thing? I don't know. I mean, if this was Sip Gen, Knock Off would be a thing. But... I'm going to Shadow Ball. Endure. Okay, fine. You brace yourself. You're probably going to live with 1 HP. I mean, you're probably going to live this anyway. Hiriyama's are kind of beefy. Oh, I guess this one's not that beefy. Okay, you withdrew, and you're going into Dugdrio. Can Dugdrio live this? Oh, no, it can't. You, like, were an idiot. You thought Dugdrio could live it, or something like that. You thought Dugdrio could deal with me. Like, no, Dugdrio's not going to deal with the Shadow Ball. Would you do that just to get off an another indoor? I think you did that just to get off another indoor, didn't you? Stop using indoor! I mean, I'm will wisping now, so this should work as my. This should be a great plan. There! <laughs> Die by burn! Because you won't. You won't let me kill you, so I'll let, I'll let After Effects kill you. Ooh, PP up. Not bad. Not bad at all. I love that. Anyway, so question today for today's episode. What is your favourite game other than Pokemon? I have quite a few. I love the uh, I love the WWE game series. I'm a huge fan of The Sims, although The Sims these days is kind of a cash pot for EA, but it's still a pretty good game. I still love Sims. I'm a huge uh, fan of it. And Life is Strange, too. An amazing game. Uh, amazing game that I'm playing through on the second channel right now, which I actually haven't played through in a while. I need to get back on to playing Life is Strange. Yeah, I need to get back on to playing Life is Strange. Life is Strange is a really good game. I really love it. It's a really fun and enjoyable game. I need to get back on to playing it. But I don't know when that's going to be. Ring out. Okay. I hit you, Flame Body. I want to see what Magma Storm can do here. Really? You're going to use a full heal? Die by fire! <laughs> oh, 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 that's an amazing move. I love it. I love it. That's an amazing move right there. Let's go into Spirit Flame and deal with this Mr. Mime. I think this this is the Doctor, so we should be able to deal with this. Yeah. I love Life is Life is Strange is just a very good game. If you've never played if you've never played Life is Strange, basically it's a time uh, spoilers now. Basically it's a time travel game where you go back in time where you can constantly rewind time and deal with it. Oh my god, this is a Wobbuffet. 
I'm in with the thing that can deal with it. I'm in the thing that can deal with it. I'm gonna spirit. I'm gonna. I'm gonna do. I'm gonna call mind. Oh damn it! I can't burn it now. I'm gonna call mind again. I'm just gonna keep on calm minding. Oh, you've learnt Calm Mind. I'm going to Calm Mind again. I didn't actually know you could learn other moves. Now you know Calm Mind. Oh dear, this is actually bad. But now you know Calm Mind. Please do not Destiny Bond. Please do not Destiny Bond. Awesome! Okay, I'm okay. Oh. <laughs> there we go. Nice and safe now. Healed and everything. That was, like, so scary. Destiny Bond is one of, like, the most scariest moves in the game if you don't know what to do about it. I think I dealt with it pretty nicely there. That's the wrong way. Uh, it's this way? I think, it, yeah, it's this way. Okay, it's this way. I guess you're not going to turn, so i got to face you. Yeah, you're not going to turn, so I have to face you. Damn! I was kind of hoping you'd turn. You just want to stand casually behind this rock and to face me. Hiker Neil has a Baldor. Well, I think I know what to do with you. Uh, which is Leech Seed and then Seed Bomb because if I can break the Sturdy, that's a good way of doing it. That's a good way of breaking Sturdy. Why do you Sandstorm up? I'm a Grass type. I'm a Ground type. You can't do anything with that. And I now broke your Sturdy, so now Seed Bomb. Awesome. There we go. And a Gigalith. Again, this is probably the best option. Break the Sturdy with Leech Seed and then go for it. There's a police car going by. Why is it every time I record, there's a police car going by my a police car, ambulance or something going past my window? I pick the worst times to record. But then again, I wouldn't know that they're the worst times to record because I can't tell when the police cars are going to come past my window. I resist that because of grass typing. I accidentally made a mis huge. I accidentally made a mistake and decided not to see Bob. But there we go. There we go. Gigalith down. And finally, your subs your uh, your sandstorm subsided. You're bringing a Probo Pass. Again, the same strategy works really nicely for Probo Pass as well. Leech Seed to break the Sturdy. I resist your Rock Slide. There we go. Break the Sturdy. This time I gotta use Earth. Wait, this time I gotta use Earthquake now. Because uh, it's a Steel Rock type and it would resist Grass type moves. So there we go. Awesome. Thick, you're amazing. You just break sturdy and just destroy. See, Leech Seed. Brilliant way of breaking sturdy. Uh, oh, there's an item here. And there's a battle here. With Don Fan. I didn't know you could find Don Fan here. That's awesome. I love Don Fan. It's a good Pokemon. It's one of the best spinners in, like, the entire Pokemon game. Ooh, an Ultra Ball. Not bad. I've already got my... I already lost my encounter for here, so sadly I cannot have this encounter. Which is kind of annoying. This day's been going... Actually, to tell you the truth, I've been up since 9 o'clock today, but, like, today has been going really slow. The time I'm recording this right now is, like, half one, but, like, I am... Done. Uh, time's gone really slow today. I don't know why. I just feel like I've had more time than I should, usually. Because by the time 
I'm usually recording this about half four, and, you know, things, I've already done a lot of things. Today, I haven't done a lot of things, but, you know, I've just been shopping and stuff like that. But the, today, it's just, it's just weird how time has gone so slow. Ooh, nice. Is it because I'm over-leveled that I just destroyed that Marchamp rather e too easily? I shouldn't be this over-leveled, should I, guys? I really shouldn't be this over-leveled. <laughs> but it's going well. I mean, most of the... Like, most Volt White and Blaze Black Nuzlocks don't actually... Sub oh, that's a, that's a Galele. That's a Galele. That's me exiting the battle because the Glalie is here. Go Ares. Yeah, you avoid the attack. Go for Fire Punch. Now, oh, that did barely nothing. Oh my god, you're... Oh, wait. You're Ice Rock type in this game. I totally forgot that Glary is Ice Rock in this game, or a Spear. Yeah, Glary is Ice Rock. Which I think is actually a really good typing for it, actually. And a Kangaskhan. Are you no more fighting in this game? I think you might be. Or you're just playing normal. You might be normal fighting them. Either way, you're dead. Nice work, Ares. Is it this way? Oh, yeah, here we are. We're on the outside now. Cool. Another one's in here. No one's in the, tr the trash. Okay. I think you come here in the after get uh, this particular cave you come to in the after game and this guy gives you a random fossil each and every day. Which is awesome because you can get all the fossils that way. And then just through there is also the ice rock where you can get uh, a glacion as well. And here's a team plasma grunt. Huh? Pretty strong. But you're only strong because you're con you're a trainer who's controlling Pokemon. So, if you set the Pokemon free, that's what you want, you should start with your own. By taking over people's Pokemon by force, that's not right. It's not real strength. Hey! There you are. We found some. Uh, we found the thing we were looking for. We should head to the tower now. Get this. Team Plasma has already obtained the power to change the world, and to control uh, to pe people's to end people's control over Pokemon. That's right. We must force in or order to use the right the wrongs of this world. Now let's gather around our king, our Lord N. Those guys. I don't know what they found, but they they've got the extra mile to gain power and cause trouble. What a bothersome bunch. Joanne, I'm going I'm going to stay here for a while. I want to think about what the champion asked me. What am I gonna do with my found my power after I become strong? And what? And why do I want to become strong in the first place? Okay, Jaren, you think. Oh, there's a duck trio here. Cool. Uh, I'm going to see bomb this thing. Oh, you dig. Um. Do I? Um, that's Earthquake. Yeah, it's Earthquake. D Dig does nothing to me, it's fine. 
There we go. Uh, in here, in here. Hey, Cedric Juniper, how you doing? Hello, Joanne. How's Torterra? He's doing well. He's a little over-leveled, but he's, uh, he's doing well. Ah, Mr. Torterra's really taking a shine to you. But Pokedex is important, but your time spent with Pokemon is equally as important. Say, I just had a thought. Have you heard of Dragon Spiral Tower? No. Really? That's quite impressive. Give this story a listen. Dragon Spiral Tower is spread to be the oldest building in the Unova region. Stories say that it is, uh, it is the place where legendary Pokemon came to life or remained deep in their slumber. It's just past Isiris City, but that's all I know about it. If anyone, That's all anyone knows, really, because no one's ever been inside. My daughter wanted to, to investigate that tower for a long time. What? There's something I don't know? That gives me a purposeful adventure! And I'm not too old for some adventuring! Anyway, I've got to go and have a look at it! Catch you later! He's just found a new purpose in life. That's good for him. And we are here in Isiris City. So yeah, I'm we're in Isiris City, which is awesome. I think we can go and get another set of experience shares in this uh, village as well. Plus the second experience share is here if you max out your if you max out your part if you max out your Pokemon's happiness, you can get a second experience share here. Plus the math uh, v quiz house is here. The Pokemon fan club is here. There's a lot of good things here. There's a lot of good things here. This is the fan. This is the Pokemon fan club. Hey, mate. Ahem. I am the chairman and who loves Pokemon among the Pokemon fans in the whole world. If you are a trainer, please... Will you show me how you are raising your Pokemon with loving care? Which oh, which Pokemon will you show me? I want to show you Spirit Flame. Oh, this Chandelure was met at level 1 and now it's level 67. You've raised it quite well. You've... I feel love for this Pokemon. We obtained a cleanse tag. That, that token is gratitude. Is a gratitude showing for great love for this Pokemon. If this was the original game, this is where you get a second experience share. But this is Blaze Black, so he's ha he's hacked it because the fact is you get six experience shares when you get the original experience share. So it would be a really bad idea to give out another six experience shares, wouldn't it? Now, if you had twelve experience shares. Anyway, this is our encounter here. Can I leech seed this thing? Because I can't really figure out what else to do. Right now, because I can't... I don't know if I can put any status elements on it. I can probably Will-O-Wisp. Yeah, I could probably Will-O-Wisp as well. Let's Will O Wisp. Let's go into Spirit Flame and Will O Wisp. Sludge Wave. Does nothing, fine. And Leech Seed will bring us back our energy that we wasted on him. So let's Will O Wisp. Okay, cool. We burnt it. We Leech Seeded it. Now, I guess the best thing we can do is just go for it and see what happens. I'm poisoned, by the way, so that's annoying. But I think we're okay. Yeah, I'm either poisoned or badly... I'm some. I'm poisoned, so I'm going to go for a Pokeball here. And we can always heal that off. So go watch a ball. One. Two. Three. Yeah! Called a level 48 Pokemon. Not bad.
And no. Okay, so we do have an encounter here, which is awesome. That's one. But I think we can get a few more encounters. So, I guess since we're done for the episode, we've got to uh, Iceris City. Let's take our flying type and our water... Uh, let's take our flying HM slave and our water HM slave and go get some more encounters. So that we have some more eggs to hatch out. And where's my phone? Okay, got my phone. Okay, so we have encounter. So now we can have encounters. Sorry about that. I'll probably cut that out of the recording. I might. I don't know. So let's go and get my flying HM slave, my water HM slave. Let's go and get some more encounters. Uh. Oh yeah. By the way, we have a Hiri armor now, which is Mar Jampu. Uh. We have Seedless, which is level 43 now and legal. We also have Grim, which was the thing we hatched out for the egg, which actually helped, which actually turned out to be a Volcarona egg, which is pretty cool. Anyway, so we can't actually have the Volcarona, despite the fact it came in its own egg, we can't we, we can't have it uh, because it's not one of the eggs given to you guys, given to me by you guys, so that would be Weird for me to just take that egg instead of an actual egg that you guys gave me. Which would be wrong. Not doing that. Uh, let's go for... Let's go for a fly. And let's fly to Driftvale City. And I think from here we can go to the Mistralton Cave. Where you normally find Terrakion. But today we're not going after Terrakion. I don't even know if we'll do it in the after. I don't even know if we'll do it when we're legendary hunting later on in the series. I do know that we are going to go and get an encounter in its cave, though. But I will tell you, we are going to go and get an encounter in its cave. Oh, there's an item here. I want that. So this episode will be a bit longer because of that reason. I want to go get an encounter. Oh, TMA4 Poison Jab. Awesome. I want to get encounters in this cave, and I think there's also an encounter we can get from the Zemo Domanitans, because we have a we have a rare candy bar, so Rage Candy Bar, which is awesome. So that means we can go get an encounter there too. There's an item here. That's a silk scarf. Not so awesome, but kind of cool. And I think that's about all the items we can get on this route for the surf. So now let's go and get that encounter. I think it's up here we need to go. And then um, then we can go in the cave. Yeah, it is. That's it. Wait, no, it ain't. Oh, yeah, it is. We can get past these rocks by just going up on land for a second. Okay, so there we are. We're in the cave. I need flash in here? Oh yeah, I need flash in here. But that's fine. We're not we're just going in here to get an encounter. We're not actually doing this. We're just getting an encounter here. Bronze art oh, sorry, I mean Beldorm, awesome. Um I want to leech seed this thing. And this is like the only takedown you can... Oh, you have Zen Headbutt in this game. I didn't know you could learn that. I honestly didn't know you... I thought you could only have takedown. Dre has hacked you again. Dre has hacked another one of these Pokemon, which made it more amazing. So now I'm going to Will-O-Wisp this thing, and that should be enough for us to get the catch. Ironhead. Okay. Okay. As long as you don't know a dark type move, I'm fine. So let's Will O Wisp. There we go. And you can't hit me with takedown. So now Leech Seed and Burn. And go for a Pokeball. One. Come on. I can only hit. I can't hit you. 
I can only do the Pokeball thing. So hopefully, event, you're either going to die or you're either going to get in my Pokeballs. Really? You're actually choosing the die option. I can't believe you actually chose the die option. You have one more... You have one more turn of living. Yeah, you have one more turn of living. I can... Uh, I think this is probably the best ball I can go for. Cherish Balls doesn't do anything. Three. Oh, I thought I had it. Die. Never mind. Never mind. I thought we could get another Pokemon. We've got one more shot. We got one more shot getting another Pokemon. That's a shame that Bra uh, that Beldum decided not to come with us. And would rather die than come with us. I guess it's because Beldum still has a 3% catch rate. So it's the same as any legendary. Uh, that's not a you know story storyline required legendary. So... Basically, it's going to have the same problems as a normal everyday legendary. It's not storyline required, so yeah, that's annoying. Do you have Arena Trap? Which if you do, you're catching a Seed Bomb. No, you don't. Okay, cool. Okay, so the final Pokemon I can get... Before advancing on to Route 8, which I'll probably do after the gy uh, gym. Although we've got Dragon Spiral Tower too, so we get an encounter there as well. And you can only get encounters there on the very first floor. That's where you get Gigalith and stuff like that. Uh, Gigalith and uh, Golet and stuff like that. Golet and stuff like that. That's where you get those Pokemon from. And Drugon. Drugon's there as well. All amazing Pokemon live there. Okay, so this is a Zen Mode Brahmanitan. Give Rage Candy Bar to the Dragon to the Pokemon statue. The Pokemon statue responded to the Rage Candy Bar. This it, the Pokemon was a Sleeping Darmanitan. The Sleeping Darmanitan attacked. Darmanitan, level thirty-five. Oh, you have sand. So Sandstorm is going to come into play here, as well as as well as my Leech Seed. Okay, you're Leech Seeded. Oh dear, this thing has now got belly. This thing has belly drum. This thing has belly drum. I've Leech Seeded, and it's gone into Zen mode. It's like Zen mode triggered. And Zen Mode makes it become a fire psychic type in this game. One, two, three. Yay! We caught the Zen Mode Domanitan. Awesome, that's two encounters. Okay, so that's two encounters. Let's get back to Iceria City and hatch those two encounters into eggs. So we have two encounters. Sadly, we can't get any more of these rage can. I think you can only get one rage candy bar, sadly. So you can only get one of those Pokemon, which I, which is all you can get really in the uh, actual Nuzlocke because uh, that's how much I set. You can get one if there's multiple set encounters in one area you can only get one of them that's my rules because it just seems wrong for you to have like if there's 50 set encounters you can have 50 pokemon that seems wrong in my books anyway i don't know about your books but that seems wrong in my books anyway so let's see what we can get for these pokemon so first off that muck So let me get my uh, uh, random number generator up. Boxes one to six. 
Again with the box fours. Damn, randomizer, you give me a box four again. Uh, right, box four. Which has got quite a lot, which has seen quite a lot of action. Pokemon 1 to 30. Pokemon number 22 in box four. Let's see if that Pokemon number is available. 6, 12, 18, 24. And back to Lady Spikes holding a Miracle Seed. Okay, so this is the encounter for that Grimer. So, let's see what it is. Also, I need to write down the nickname. So, let me do that. Lady Spikes. Let me write down this nickname. So, I serious city. Lady Spikes. And E and then S. Okay, and your level I think you were like level 43 or something like that, but I'll check. That's a lot of uh, question marks after the name, actually, which I will not be doing. I will just put Lady Spikes. <laughs> I don't do with the after things, but I'm pretty sure that's all it's going to fit. Okay, so what is Lady Spikes? It's a Maractus. That's pretty cool. You do not see many people use a Maractus. I would not mind actually putting this in the team if I lose a poke. If I lost my, uh, if I lost Fick, I would not mind putting this in the team because you do not see many people use a Maractus. You do not see that. You see people use other. You see people use Torterra because Torterra is pretty cool, but you don't see people use Maractus. That is in. That is a very interesting Pokemon to use. That is very, very interesting. I am so like, excited to see what I can do with it. I realize now that I need to put this on what... This needs to be all one word for it to fit. Okay. So, I will do that now. I need to make this all one word so it fits. I and a K and an E and an S. Lady Spikes. Let's take a look at Lady Spikes to Maractus. Okay, so Adamant Nature. Uh, no, that's like Lonely Nature, pushing the attack, reducing defense with Wood Hammer, Bullet Seed, Seed Bomb, and Absorb. I honestly don't know if this is legal. I'm going to find out because I will check off screen. But the fact is, I've never used a Maractus before, so I wouldn't even know where to begin with this Pokemon. Are you special? Are you physical? I have no clue with Maractus. You have Storm Drain for an ability, which is awesome. But I don't, I, I don't even know if that's legal. I've never used a Maractus. Box two, okay. So for the Zemo Darmanitan, box two, and Pokemon number one, uh, Pokemon numbers one to thirty. What are we gonna get? Pokemon number twenty nine. There it is. Let's see what that is. That is Littlefoot with leftovers. So let me put that down. Uh, let me put that down. This is Littlefoot. So this is L I T T. Oh, damn, my writing is big. I went a bit too far with the writing. Anyway, so this is Littlefoot holding leftovers. Let's see what Littlefoot is.
Okay, little foot. What's it gonna be? Ooh, it's a Chikorita. I don't get a chance to use them often, that, uh, that often either. So, this is Littlefoot. Littlefoot the Chikorita. I don't get a chance to use Chikorita either. This, this has been a really good episode for Grass-type Pokemon. Which is weird, because we're going into an Ice-type gym where Grass-type Pokemon would be the worst idea ever. But, I like it, personally. Uh, this is Littlefoot. So, again, all one word. There you go, little foot. And let's see what little foot has for us. Little foot is a calm nature holding leftovers. Uh, overgrowth for the ability with aromatherapy, leech seed, see, uh, leaf storm, and ring out. Okay. So I will check Littlefoot's moveset off screen, see if it is legal, and I'm going to end today's episode so here. So if you enjoyed today's episode, please leave a like, comment, and subscribe. And today's question of the day, which of course is, what is your favorite video game other than Pokemon? Let me know in the comment section down below. But until next time, I'm just PH Games, and I am out. I think in the next episode, we'll be taking you on the gym right here in Iceris City. So until next time, good night.